Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to NASCAR 2005 Chase for the Cup Career Mode Series, where today we are racing at Atlanta. This is episode 19 or 20, no, episode 20. We finally made it to a different number in the front, number 2, 20. So we've already done qualifying. We're starting eighth. It was actually an impressive qualifying run. I did not expect it to go that well at all. Honestly, hoping for a win. We really could use it, and I'm really hoping we can get it here. Um, and we'll see how it goes. This is our first, like, real, real race in the truck series, so without further ado, here we go. I'm actually going to turn that down. I made a very slight adjustment, and I'm going to make it even slighter. Alrighty. Real race in the trucks. Undergo. Under green. information. I wouldn't mind a top 10 here. Sorry, buddy. Not intentional. Didn't mean to hit you like that. Also, I was kind of not anticipating you uh, how finding the walls everywhere. Mark, I'm being friends with this guy for a little bit. I don't know what happened. Andy, I was trying to be your friend, man. Don't get that mad at me that quickly, man. You checked up and I hit you. I'm sorry. It happens. Accidents happen. Oh, are you kidding me, dude? That wasn't on purpose. I'm trying to race clean, yeah. Hey, I might just be a little too aggressive for like the way the controls are in the game. God, it's crazy how bad of habits you get from NASCAR <laughs> heat games. Like, I am making a lot of my own mistakes here. Like, if I just apexed my corners right, I'd be fine. And I don't want this guy up here to be my enemy, not at all. I want to make him my friend again, and I'm going to try to work on that. It was one incident, so I'm hoping he's not super mad at me, and he's just, like, upset with me a little bit. So that I can maybe make it better. Oh, thank God for RK physics that let me bounce off that wall. I racing, I would have been sucked into that wall and been sitting there for a while. Alright, I'm dialing it in. I'm dialing it in. We're good. Yep, I'd be mad at me too, buddy. Oh, I drafted the wrong guy. Just trying to get the 64 to be my buddy. Sorry, Andy. It was not meant to be me. I meant to help you. I really did. I really did. I'm not lying. Hopefully we can make him a little less mad at us and maybe be an ally. I mean, I'm going to have one rival in this series, obviously, but I'd rather have it be the one who's already my rival who I dumped at Daytona. Still riding up here in the top 15. Slid up the track a little bit there as I'm just so focused on. Oh, I think it's not someone who's kind of smoking out there. I don't really know what happened. It seemed like someone was getting smoky, but it might have just been a weird fog glitch of some sort. Alright, Andy. I'm sorry. Sorry, mate. Didn't mean to hit you. It's not outside. I'm all clear. Make the right calls, man. It's your job. Wow, the car plowed tight there, right up the track. Are we actually clear? We are. <laughs> I, I wanted to be your friend. Oh, I am plowing so tight. Do I? Or are you lying to me? Sometimes you lie to me, man. Sometimes you lie to me. Alright, this time I actually do have someone inside. <clears throat> it's not still there. You're lying to me. Ouch. Oh, 
causing myself more problems by trying to be friends with people than I would have would be by just not being friends with everybody. I just need the car to hug that bottom line. We're up in the sixth position though, so we're running pretty good here. We're working on it. This could go really well. I just have to remember that Daytona's just the mean track to race up. Oh, Jason Powell likes me. That's good. Jason, don't follow me. I might go right up into the wall. Definitely have to work on maybe loosening up the car a little bit more. Hopefully I can outpower him out of the corner. I will ish. Ish. <laughs> that was a first. I will ish. I certainly want to break away from the pack. My car did not care that I wanted to turn there at all. Alright, Jason's a little bit of our friend, that is good. I did not put him into the wall. Dude, I need to stop hitting the fucking wall, man. What's wrong with me? Alright, man. I can't keep it together right now. Oh, no! It's gonna put me all the way to last because I wrecked there. It did it. I will pit. Will anyone else pit? Just me. But it said I'm halfway on fuel, so I have to assume it's gonna be hard to make it. Okay, we'll do that. Uh, we'll, we'll take a little wedge out to give it a little bit looser. Repair our damage. We're looking at a 16 second pit stop, which will work for me. I'll make that work. Here we go. First pit stop of the race. Trying our best to, but, you know, having some problems. Good thing is we're making more friends than we're losing them, and that's good. Very good. Come on, guys. Wicked good pit stop. You got me fixed up. Everything. Great. We'll take that. I am going to start out back, but I can make it on field. You need to stop starting me in the wrong gear, though. That ain't nice. That ain't fair. I got fresh tires, though, and they don't. So that's kind of worth it. I mean, it sucked that I wrecked, but... I got fresh tires for this whole run. And if I was halfway on fuel before 16 laps to go, I've got to assume they are going to be too. That was so dumb. You guys are really going to pit right now? <coughs> what was the logic in that? <coughs> Is this when you got enough fuel to go the rest of the way? I mean, I'll just pull up the whole fuel. I don't mind. Jesus. That wedge adjustment made all the difference for our car, though, I'll tell you that much. Let's try to just take good care of our truck here. And hopefully it, uh, pays off. One can hope. One can hope. That adjustment was really good for it, though. I'm really liking how that adjustment has panned out. So we are going to put those guys who pit a lap down which is beneficial to us later on and we are basically on the same strategy as them they have one lap newer everything than I do but even if I had to go with that sort of a strategy not all of them came in the pit I'm still out here I'm enjoying this. I am just like saving fuel right now. So I know they're all gonna pit and we're gonna take the lead. So there's like nothing to be stressed out about. This is great. This is excellent. So the game seems to automatically kind of port the fuel in the tires to be how they should be. So I guess while it doesn't have the ability for you to trigger it yourself, it makes you pit as much as you should. And I guess this is a race where you would pit twice. If it was a normally 
length race, which I don't remember a truck race from 2005 off the top of my head. Maybe I'll watch one. And there comes the rest of them, pretty much. There's one more staying out, but that's pretty much all of them, so we could inherit the lead. I just have to try to save fuel here as much as I can. That 110 car, I think, is out of fuel, potentially, because I am catching him in a hurry. I don't know what his logic is with staying out this long, because I don't think it's a good one. But hey, whatever does it for him, and he does pit, so we will inherit the lead here. By a long time. I think they're all going to be a lap behind me. <clears throat> While I don't know if we'll lead the most laps... We could. So if we put it on lap 16, we're halfway. Actually, we're not halfway. I think we'll scrape by on fuel. Alright, so we are a lap ahead of everybody. Which does mean that we can do a splash and go and be okay. Um, even with the splash and go, we should be able to pit and get the whole thing. And that guy's the closest to it. So, we're more than a lap ahead of everyone. So, this strategy of pitting when that caution happened, when I got spun out, weirdly worked out for us, which is great. I will take it. I will call that and consider that a, a, a very big benefit. So, it appears that we, we should be able to make it the rest of the way. I, 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 I can't understand why they didn't pit. I, 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 it completely defeats me why they did not pit. I don't think the high line's a thing in this game. They might be a touch faster than me too, but that's okay. I mean, we're leading laps, we're getting points, I and mean, this is going to really help us out here in the standings. I mean, we'll probably come out of this game in the top 15 in points. You can have it, man. All for it. Take it if you want it. I don't care. I mean, I'm only a lap ahead of you. Take it. It's all yours. Alright, so the next guy behind me is 30 seconds behind me, so not very concerned about that. I am now halfway on field, so we will make it. That basically confirms that we can make it. I'll work on becoming this guy's friend for now. Because why not? I'm assuming share draft saves you money. I'm leading and share drafting, so I'm getting a lot of points right now too, which is great. And he's becoming my friend. So unlike how I went in the modifieds where I made a million enemies, in this series I'm making a million friends. Car got a little squirrely out of the corner there, so we will have to be cautious of it. We got uh, six laps to go. It'll be five laps to go next time. Bye, which is awesome. We are making excellent fucking time right now, too, which is great. Billy Wilson is our friend. Working with him is working out great for me. I don't know what my squatter said exactly. You got someone inside? Do we actually, or are you just giving me shit? Five more laps. Uh, no, 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 no. I did intend to. I did intend to. That's all I can say. Alright, let's just limp this thing back to the finish line. That guy kind of messed up my whole thing there. Alright, so our pitch strategy does have its issues in it. Because everyone's trying to wreck me right now, which is not fun. I'll let you all buy. Don't worry about it. All go by me. You can all go by me. I do not mind running a little bit slower than all of you. It's quite the strategy I'm running, and I understand that. And I do not mind just slowing way down to keep it going. I don't mind riding in the wall. I don't mind any of it. I just want to be there to win the race. Which I should be able to be. 
god. I'm so afraid. I'm just afraid of them wrecking me. The car is ungodfully loose. I will tell you guys that much. It is very loose. Like, I am fighting this car really hard right now to keep it going. Oh yeah, they're all really worn and my wedge adjustment is not paying dividends at the moment. But we're good to run this slow. And we should be able to just finish off the race uh, running really slow like this. I just want to catch a gap in the pack, which I will catch after these guys get by me. And they will all be on the lead lap, which is whatever. But it's going to be the white flag next time by, so we should be able to make it. But I am, I am like, pedaling the throttle and everything to the extreme. Hey, Keith. One of my friends in the game, which is cool. It's always good to have friends. I will go up and use the wall to keep me going. That works. All right, white flag is out. We just gotta survive, and we led the most laps. Excellent, by one lap. By one lap, we led the most laps. All right, excellent. <laughs> How about that pit road strategy? Our car is on its last fucking leg, limping across the line with barely any gas into three and four at Atlanta in our second NASCAR truck series race. We're gonna win and get it done and make a big improvement on our point standings. Excellent, how about that guys? How about that? How about it? By so much too, by so much. Wow, how about that? So we have one rival, five allies. Excellent stuff. Exactly what you want to see. You would think I would have done the burnout there. We also now have enough money to do the truck series. But anyways, guys, thank you very much for joining for that episode. That ended up being a lot of fun. I actually really enjoyed that race. Uh, outside of the play trucks, it's a lot of fun. So, again, thank you for joining. I will see you guys in the next video. Sure to leave a like, follow, uh, click the subscription button, and notify the ring bell thing and you guys know the thing and i'll see you in the next episode till next time